So Ben, what what will happen today? It's hard to predict here what will happen, so I ask you. Yeah, it's really hard. I think uh, with tomorrow in mind, it's going to be the last chance for the breakaway. It's been a really aggressive race so far, so I think today will be a big fight for the break, and that's what will survive. No chance for a sprint? I don't think so. There's not really no teams for the sprint teams. I think if the sprint teams or the teams that have sprinters like EF and Israel, if they start moving, then for sure it'll be a breakaway. So you will try for the breakaway for yourself? Maybe. You've just got to see the numbers and see who's going, see how long it takes. I think it could be similar to yesterday where it's going to take a long time. So if you are in a breakaway and uh, how to manage the end really, because it's uh, the last real climb is far from the finish line yet it's still up and down in the last kilometers, how to, to tackle that really? Uh, it depends who else is in the breakaway, you know, and uh, if there's anybody that you need to try and get rid of or if people are trying to get rid of you and stuff like that. So. Racing in breakaways is a lot different to how you'd approach it in a sprint, so you just got to be ready for uh, an aggressive day. How do you feel? How are the legs after this uh, exhausting stages? Say that again? How is the shape after this uh, really hard stages? Ah, yeah, I've had a hard program, Paris Nice, San Remo, Copper Bartley, so I've done a lot of racing. We've been racing really fast here and the average speeds have been hard and uh, everybody's in great condition, so yeah, I'm happy with how I'm going. I'd like to have been a little bit better, but it's been a super hard race and hopefully once I rest after here, I'll, uh, I'll be better. Thank you very much. Best of luck.